left was a little bit earlier, and you can see it almost looks like a fire. Well, it's not, okay? This is debris from a tornado, and it is forming, and it is forming right in our midst. We are right across the river, Monarch Tower, from this particular storm, and we were live when this happened. And it eventually, what you're going to notice is that it was strong enough to actually suck the water out of the Connecticut River, and it's going to go across a bridge that has people on it. Okay? That's why we're telling you on Route 32, you do not want to be on that road and you don't want to be out staring at your windows wondering what you can see. This is what you can see, but you don't want to be that close. Look at all the folks there right on the river living in West Springfield. Everybody's house got damaged here. And what we hoped is if every, everybody was in their basement at the time, or they ran to their basement, or they ran to their bathroom here. Look at this. It is flowing up debris right next to our building. You see how close we were to this storm? There are people on that road, and you saw what happened, knocking those trucks over and pushing cars together, throwing the billboards out. This storm approached us, stopped, went down the river instead of coming right at Monarch Tower, and then continued to go east after it. How lucky were we here at CBS3 Springfield that something worse didn't happen to our own studios, and we were also able to bring you this coverage so that you could stay safe, because this is a very bad situation. Now, this is earlier. I want to point this out. This is not happening now. This is minutes ago as it came across West Springfield and Springfield and headed toward Wilbraham. Now, what I want to do is show you the current look of what's going on right now here on Doppler, if we can. And I want to show you, I want you to keep in mind that particular system as you look at the Doppler radar map, and you're going to see what we're dealing with in terms of the weather.